NASA's unexpected turn of events, the James Webb Space Telescope has made a discovery involving astronomers the whole world and uh. In the last few weeks, the telescope identified the earliest galaxy in the universe. However, it has now discovered something even larger, a massive black hole that is moving away from its galaxy at 4 million miles per hour, an incredible speed. This recent discovery has significant implications and has resulted in great scientific speculation and space enthusiasm about its significance for the comprehension of the universe. The launch of the James Webb Space Telescope on a mission to explore the universe's first stars and galaxies has captured the death of stars and galaxies from a few hundred million years after the Big Bang in stunning images. We invite you to join us to explore the most recent findings from this telescope. Keep up the good work by liking and subscribing to content similar to this one. The newest discovery is challenging the scientific community's current understanding of black holes. Black holes, typically thought of as huge entities that pull everything, even light, toward them are having the opposite effect in this case. The newly discovered black hole appears to be creating new, young stars along a long trail. This brand new constellation of stars has been observed in the wake of the black hole, which stretches an incredible to 100,000 light years away. Scientists are puzzled by the unusual behavior of this black hole compared to others. However, a team led by a professor of geoastronomy, Binda, recently reported their findings in the Astrophysical Journal Letters. NASA's Hubble Space Telescope also confirmed these observations, implying that the black hole comes to life when it comes into contact with new stars and gas, keeping it cool. We can now see the wake behind the black hole. Yet, that's not all. NASA has created a thrilling announcement about the merger of the galaxies, ARP 220, which the James Webb Space Telescope took control of. This impressive galactic merger can be seen shining among other galaxies in the night sky. The result of merging to spiral galaxies, this phenomenon shines as ARP 220, the highest in infrared light, making it perfect for the James Webb Space Telescope to observe. It is categorized as an extremely bright infrared galaxy with a luminosity equivalent to a trillion suns compared to our own galaxy, the Milky Way, which is much less bright at about 10. ARP 220 can be found in the Serpent's constellation approximately 250 million light years away. It is regarded as the brightest of the three collisions with other galaxies closest to Earth and is listed as the 220th object in the catalog of unusual galaxies. To spirals formed about 700 million years ago, a massive collision between galaxies caused an explosion of star formation. This created a dense region about 5,000 light years across with approximately 200 large star clusters. Surprisingly, this small area contains as much gas as the entire Milky Way. Previous observations with a radio telescope discovered about 500 supernova remnants in an area 100 miles across. After that, the ALMA telescope revealed that the parent galaxies are separated by 1,200 light years and that there is a rotating ring in each core of star formation that emits dazzling infrared light. The latest views from the James Webb Space Telescope reveal an impressive galactic merger of the two galaxies. This image also shows faint tidal tails extending from the outer edges of the merger, indicating the force of gravity between the two galaxies. Finally, the red, chevron, and orange filaments and streams represent scattered organic materials in ARP 220. Another stunning discovery stumped scientists when researchers found galaxies from the beginning of the universe. They had doubts about their authenticity, some believed they might be nearby galaxies in disguise. So, they shared the data with other researchers all over the world, hoping for the best. Amazingly, the James Webb Space Telescope confirmed that these are real ancient galaxies. Thanks to this revolutionary telescope, we can now observe the oldest galaxies ever seen. Astronomers estimate that light from these galaxies has traveled more than 13.5 billion years to reach Earth, allowing us a glimpse of the origin of the universe. 
These galaxies were discovered when the universe was young, which sheds light on how quickly the first generations of galaxies emerged. The spectral data confirmed that these galaxies are at the edge of our view, some even farther away than Hubble could see. This discovery is crucial because it validates one of the most important responsibilities of the James Webb Space Telescope, which is to study the early universe by means of light that has been traveling for more than 13.5 billion years. The capacity for extreme measurement distinguishes James Webb, allowing astronomers to peer into the infrared range and observe the first galaxies. Galaxies in the universe, the investigation, as this discovery is made, can be felt in the air. It marks a significant turning point in the discovery of the universe and in understanding its evolution. Our lives have been profoundly altered by this discovery. Understanding of the universe has prompted NASA to expand its development of strong telescopes, such as those used in the James Webb Space Telescope, to determine whether your comprehension of the Big Bang is correct. Information gathered by the telescope spectrometer and near-infrared camera has revealed that four of the six galaxies observed in the beginning have pronounced redshifts indicating we are observing them as they were between 300 million and 5 billion years after the Big Bang without heavy elements such as carbon. This surprises me because the universe is thought to be 13.8 billion years old and the existence of these galaxies suggests they could improve our comprehension of the early universe. Concern has been raised in the scientific community as these new discoveries challenge the current Big Bang and cosmological inflation model, which has some loopholes, such as breaking the rules of thermodynamics and a lack of clear description of the events that led to the Big Bang. Furthermore, the James Webb Space Telescope is almost finding galaxies as old as the Big Bang itself, which questions everything we believed we knew about the origin of the universe. A theoretical physicist claims the discovery of ancient galaxies by the James Webb Space Telescope has called into question everything we knew about the beginning of the universe. In the past, these galaxies were believed to be less advanced than the Milky Way. However, the new findings indicate that we may be missing important information. The fact that the telescope has discovered six galaxies in existence 500,000 years after the Big Bang, which can be as much as 10 times larger than the Milky Way, raises the possibility that our current theories about the creation of the universe may not be accurate. Kaku stated that it requires billions of years to create a galaxy like the Milky Way. Therefore, the discovery of such large, young, primordial galaxies may necessitate revising and rewriting the textbooks on the beginning of all things. Findings from the James Webb Space Telescope test our assumptions. We thought we were familiar with the Big Bang, but these discoveries put scientists in a bind. NASA recently tweeted about a cluster of galaxies that is just 650 million years after the Big Bang, adding yet another fascinating component to the puzzle. Astronomers have analyzed the data and concluded that this fledgling cluster is anticipated to expand in size and become something like the immense Coma A1656 cluster. Where all of this is taking place is unique and special, as it is in an area of accelerating galactic advancement. As a result of the James Webb Space Telescope, researchers can now measure the speeds at which these seven galaxies move, which inspires confidence in them to verify that they are contiguous in an early cluster. To put this in perspective, NASA scientists compared these distant galaxies to small drops of water in various rivers, which will eventually join together to form a large, powerful river. Clearly, what we previously believed about the Big Bang is not meeting expectations. Even more revealing data from the telescope provides evidence that could either support or refute the concept. Perhaps the Big Bang did occur, but the cause is a different story. Regardless, we must wait for additional discoveries, but the answer may be closer than we think. What are your thoughts on these discoveries? Please share your ideas in the comments box, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you so much for watching.